How we doing guys and welcome it's Kraken here and we've got just one question for you can a nerd survive the zombie apocalypse how we doing guys welcome back it is day number 54 we are getting up there into the high game stages now we're going to go and do Wayne Manor today but I was lying in bed this morning yes I do have a bed even though I'm meant to be an octopus I do have a bed and I was lying there this morning thinking I'm making all this steel up all this steel, hundreds and hundreds of steel. My calculations could not be more wrong if I ever tried. Because we're making here 350 steel. And we've got no iron in here either, actually. 350 steel. That is only actually going to do 34 blocks. I needed to put a zero on the end of that number. So the most I can do is 12 hundred and i'm actually going to need all of that probably a bit more so i think i'm going to need about three thousand so i'm actually going to make that and that is going to take quite some time so we're going to leave that going for the whole day and i hope i haven't messed this up again it would not surprise me um right that is all that is all i've got at the moment so you're going to carry on making all of that we're probably going to have to get some wood out on route now we are going to go and do wayne manor that's all got to go back to the other fusimaflasm ah there we go we've got actually he's got some more wood in here that's got to go back over to the hall base i cannot cannot forget that um let's get you up there right i need to get some food water all the basic gubbins and then we can get over towards Wayne Manor so let's get cracking right here she is Wayne Manor one of the best one of my favorite POIs in the game right let's just make sure we have everything on us we've got the lucky looter goggles we have got all of our gubbins here I haven't got any repair kits but that's not a big problem you are loaded make sure you are loaded yes Anything on our bikes that we need? We've got the eye candy ready for the end. We've got the health bars there as well. Right. This is a clear, so we're going all the way through this. All of the way. And make sure you're loaded. No, you can do a bit more. Good stuff. Right. This does worry me a little bit because this is... um. We're going to see some... That's new. We're going to see some big, big problems in here. Our first couple. Three of them awake already. Ooh, that's a good start. Come on, get yourself minty fresh, Homer. Wow. Well, like I was saying about big problems, there you go. Concussion instantly, infection instantly. How many times did I have to hit him? Jesus. Whew. Right, well... And they weren't even particularly hard zombies. Right, well, let's get one of these in. Now, I don't think... How far can I get out of here? Yeah, I can reach my bike. Oh, I have actually brought a herbal antibiotic. We're definitely going to be taking one of those. Yeah, let's take a herbal antibiotic. Because we have no honey on us. Right. Play smart, Kraken. Let's make sure we have our backup. That 
was insane. I, I can't believe that. When the screen starts going a little bit dark like that, it always puckers you up. Make sure we have a retreat point. I don't know. No, nobody hiding in there. Get you reloaded. We've only actually got eight of these, but to be honest, now we've put the difficulties up, I don't know how how good that is going to be for us. Level six wrench there, though. All potato seed. That we definitely need to keep hold of. That's why I'm still raiding some of these little places. I would like to get our garden done and dusted. How are we doing over here? 120 health. Okay, we're picking it, picking it back up nicely. Right. Now, you guys are not going to be doing much for me there, so... Bit more iron for us there. Right, now we do need to go into this garage. So I'm going to point you that way, and I'm going to point you this way, just in case. I'm pretty sure... No, it looks like we're clear in here. Destroy workbench, okay. Again, we're going to be scrapping most things in here. I don't want to be tied down at all when it comes to weight. Right, pick you up. In fact, we'll pick you up as well. I know there's definitely people in this direction. That goes back out to the front. Right, so we're now the other side. Nobody there. Right. There is people. Zombies in those cupboards over there. I know this because one here to do a clear I nearly drove off right hello Ooh. See what I mean there? Heavy sleepers here. Heavy, heavy sleepers. So I thought I'd done the whole mission down to the end and I was like, still hadn't cleared it. And that was because of those guys there. Right, steroid, anything else in here? Needle and thread. May as well get the purse while we're here. No. Right, good work guys. I believe that's the bottom floor clear. I think we can go up the stairs now. And that does worry me. Let's um Yeah, that goes through into there, that's there. Anything under here? Gunpowder. Right, before we run upstairs though, I am going to quickly unload a load of this rubbish onto the bike. Even though we can't get encumbered per se, it's um... Yeah. I just don't want to be carrying all that rubbish on me. As he says, and goes straight to another garbage pile. Right, and another one. Sound like um... DJ Khaled. Cool. Wanted to keep coming back and checking the other guy. Ooh, that health bar though has done wonders. Look, only 24 seconds left. Only 24 seconds left on the old tennis knee. Right, this can be our retreat point for a second. Anything else 
else in here? No. I like this stumber Tom. Something tells me he might be um he might have met his match now. Might be a bit too much for him. No, nothing else up here. Right, outside now. I can't remember if there's any vultures out here. Like I say it's been a it's been a while. I don't think I've Yeah, I've come here once in Alpha 19. Only the once. And definitely not on these settings. Now I think we're okay for a vulture out here. There is gonna be some zombie action in a minute though. Rotten flesh, well that's definitely gonna help us. Right, we're definitely gonna drink that now. Because we're a little bit low on the old waterage. Right, let's um set you guys up. Please don't fall through the earth. No, that's good. You guys worry me now. Right, let's go. Please follow the light. There's a red light over there. Red dot. Let's see what we can do. Not a lot. That's why we need the backup. That's why we need the backup. Right, let's just double check you guys for ammo. So no little oh, hello. Nobody has actually said that those shells are better. Now when I did check the price, yes I did check the price on them individually, not on the price of them when you bulk craft them, because they are cheaper when you bulk craft them. Even still, it gave us a good idea of the prices of them. So yes, the AP ammo is better, but that's better when you've actually got armour, going through armour. So, not every zombie has armour. Oh, that's miserable. Alright, let's get our light back on. Now we're going up to the library. This, I want these out for. Now, they're very clever, the fun pimps up here, because you can't see any of them. Even if you have a sniper rifle or some of the best equipment in the world, you can't see any of them. They are all hidden. See the red dots of side appearing? Are right, you going to let me open a bookcase? Pistol Pete book. You fell behind my turrets. Alright, where's the rest of you? There we go. Starting to see just rads everywhere now. And you are running against a ladder. Okay, clever man. Right, let's reload. Let's go and sort you out. Not very clever at all, are you, buddy? Did that kill you? Yeah, it did. Only two? No, surely not. It's all these nooks and crannies that are normally hiding in. Okay, right. Well, you guys can cover me and we're going to loot the library. Right then, it's a bit of fun, wasn't it? 
this is what I was looking for, the polymer string. That's going to be one of the other mods we can put on our compound crossbow. So I am really happy about learning that one. These ones we already know we, why we're here. Cooling mesh. Bit late in the game for that one now, but good to know anyway. The grenades, the lights. Somebody actually mentioned about putting lights on the horde base, which we could definitely do that. Right, we... Hello. Am I lucky Luda Goggles back? Can't read you, so we'll get rid of you. Pistol P, what are you going to do? Craft armor piercing 9 mil rounds. Okay. And Ranger's Guide to Archery. Okay. All good. More lockpicks. And we're going to scrap you two. Right. Let's go and get our turrets back. And let's get cracking. Let's carry on with this. So this room's clear in here as well. We've got some armor. There's some ammo. Not that any of the ammo we're using though. Okay, we've got another splint. Got plenty of splints downstairs. We'll just quickly scrap you. What have we got here? You know things are getting dicey and worrying when the game starts giving you ammo and health supplies. Some more gunpowder, nothing behind you. Quite a few resources in here as well, but always a bit of fun. Right, let's go down the elevator shaft. And we go. Beautiful. Right. Now, I do not want you guys falling through the earth. Thank you. Pretty sure we can see red dots down there. Just needed to check behind me. Make sure that was a wall. Good work, come on. Good stuff. Good work, boys. Good, good work. So you used a bit of ammo, though. Gotta be, gotta be careful with that. Now, can't go through there, so we need to go this way. Always follow the lights. So you can't actually see behind there. Done a very good job to make sure you can't see in that room. In you go. And you can come out here. That's it. We'll wake up. There we go. If the first one can't get you, the second one definitely will. Look at that for efficiency. Look at that. Oh, what a POI this place is. What a POI. Look at this place. I've gone through here once with my hacker's candy and wrenched literally everything. There's enough electrical parts and mechanical parts for the entire game. Well, we're not going to go down there because all it does is bring you there. So, oh my god. Woke you up already. Uh, best place for you. Cool. Ready or not, here I come. Definitely no hide and seek with you boys. Now we're meant to be getting more loot drops when we got that lucky looter book. That doesn't seem to be happening. Does not seem to be happening at all. Right.
Well, I apologise now if I'm a little bit quiet, but this place does make me extremely nervous. Because last time I was here, I died. And I don't like dying. Unfortunately, it does seem to happen a little too, too, too often for my liking. Right, let's get ourselves into here. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. To be honest, I should be in a better situation now. Why oh, so many steroids? Because I have green tea and Mr. Tea here. Uh, how far back do I want you guys? Right, here we go. Ooh, right. Let's go. Gaza, go. Are you dead? Quickly reload. Oh, now that was not bad. Good work, boys. You managed to sort of cop out. Nigel, big mama. What have we got in there? Oh, another stumbaton. Somebody said why well, I keep getting the stumbaton parts, because I know what I'm like. Chances are I will forget. Now it says there's somebody alive above. Now that's normally everybody. So unless I've forgotten about somebody, which is a big probability that I have, but normally that clears that room out. Just in case it is in this room. Which I don't believe it is. I'm going to get the medical piles before we take the eye candy. Oh, I think we've I think we've forgotten about somebody. Yeah, this is um this is this is it. And this is the room that we were in. Right, let me get this all opened up and I'm gonna empty things onto my bike. And then before we take the eye candy quickly shut you up. Before we take the eye candy, we're going to um We're gonna go and hunt down this final zombie. Right, here we go. I've just broken my way out of the hole like I showed you guys in the other episode. Now, it's saying 25 metres away on this level. So, I'm pretty sure we cleared the bottom floor, but we did see how heavy they were sleeping. Now, we went to the other side of this door. What did I miss down here? 13 metres. Ah! Ah! Mm-hmm. Right, we never went through this door. So let's set up our ambush. Wakey, wakey. Come on. You can do it. There we go. Return to the trader. Yes, good work, boys. Well, we got through it. We got through it, which is um, which is damn good stuff. What a POI. I love this POI. I kind of like playing with this, the backup of the turrets. I haven't played with these turrets for so long. In Alpha 18, when they were introduced they were so so op so so op right jailbreakers lucky looters cracking stuff eye candy here we go Ooh, a tier 6 sniper rifle so I've just found the polymer string mod for this oh 
I might be swapping over. Oh, a Desert Vulture schematic, a Deagle. Good, good stuff. Okay, well, we'll definitely be making one of those. Is that better than the leg armor we're wearing? I'll have to check that out in a second. Uh, we're going to sell you in a second as well. I think that's the same as the gloves and stuff we're wearing. Ammo pile. Oh, a tier 5 auto shotgun. And we have got so many shotgun shells, but we have not specced any... Well, to be fair, we haven't specced into any gun. We're going to have to restart thinking about what kind of... Uh, weapons we're going to be specking into because we've been this tactical assault rifle has been amazing for us but we haven't put any points into machine guns at all none whatsoever right what we've got here medical pile oh that's very good for uh, to have in a medical pile very very good not often you see that. <laughs> and another crucible. Crucibles for everybody. I can't believe what good time we've actually made on that. Great, great timing. Right, let's get to um let's get to the trader. Right, here we go. We're at the trader. In fact, let's make sure, yeah, we got our XP goggles on. We want all the XP. What have you got for me? Health bar, most definitely. Skull crushes, yes. Another eye candy and a rock busters. Beautiful. Nothing else here? No. I might have to put a point. Have I got a spare point? I've got one. I've, I might have to put one into Master Chef so I can make red tea and things like that because... It's becoming a bit of a pain that I can't do that. You must Trader Hugh. Oh! Our agreement. There we go. The tier 6 Stumbertom. So even if that is slightly lower on specs, I'm not sure. What have we got here? Melee damage of 18. We can put an extra mod into this. We've got to get it. We've got to get it. Do you have any other jobs for me? 700 meters. What are you? The church. We've just done the church. As much as we like that. What have we got here? I got a job for you. Red Messer. We've done the Red Messer. Give me something new. I have a little assignment. Oh, the gun store. Oh, yes, I'm very interested. Talk to me. Talk to me, Hugh. Right, let's quickly sell you some stuff. You can't even sell the crucible. That's very interesting. I thought it'd be worth a little a little fortune. Right, what do we got here? What have we got for sale? Rocket launcher ammo. Sniper rifle magnum M60. Compound crossbow. He's got two red tees. Not paying a thousand pounds. Animal fat. Yucca Suvino, I'm fine with that. Right, unfortunately, even with his secret stash, he doesn't really have anything for us at all. I guess you're not so bad after So all. let's look at that. Number six compared to number five. So the only difference is actually the durability. Now, in fact, I've got this spear that I'm going to sell to you. And we've got this sniper rifle. Thank God you're done browsing. I'm That's thinking of specking him completely out. We've got level 8 scope. Or times 8 scope. Well, I hope we've still got it anyway. I sincerely hope we've still got it. So you're... Over in, there's our hometown. Ah, over here. So it's in an area we still haven't even gone and explored. Hmm, very interesting. Right, well, there we go, guys. That's going to be the gun store, and a gun store we haven't seen before. I hope it's the really, really good gun store, because, ah, oh, there's uh, the shotgun range. 
the rifle range is um is one hell of a POI. Guys, I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. Sorry I was a bit nervous and a little bit quiet. Not the easy Sunday morning that I normally go for, but damn, damn good fun. Guys, that's why I'm going to leave you. As always, a big thumbs up on the video. Hope you've enjoyed it, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Take it easy.